Walking on Water is the conclusion of this five book series, so it was really important to me that I got something that was really worthy of, of the five years that people have been walking with me. So on one, on one hand, I felt a tremendous amount of pressure to uh, make something that people would feel like, um, as my editor said, has all the, the movie music at the end that you hit there and you go, yes, yes, that's what I wanted. Uh, she said, we better be crying at the end of the book. And what I didn't realize is the book is by far the most emotional of all of them, I think. There's some really personal things in there. It's, um, it's about a relationship between a father and a son. It's about what happens when we lose touch to the past. It, it's about um, maybe not moving on, but moving forward. And so it was a matter of taking all these uh, tremendous losses that Alan has faced and trying to make sense of them, but also at the end to give the reader a, a feeling of hope. And so you just, you know, on a music level, you just want to make sure that last note just hits just right and the reader can take a deep breath and go, wow, that was the right. I started to write the walk series. I actually started with him on the road and then doing the kind of these flashbacks and it just wasn't hitting with me and I wanted a freshness to it. I wanted a sense of improv. So, so what I really did is I hopped in a car with my daughter and we drove from coast to coast. And uh, in doing that, we just had such amazing experiences along the way. And that's why the book has kind of the, the richness and the freshness that it has, I think. Coming to the end of the walk uh, was actually a, a little bit emotional. When I hit the, um, the other coast with my daughter, Jenna, um, and we saw the Atlantic Ocean, and here we had started you know, by the Pacific, uh, it was a very emotional experience. And I realized this is how Alan would feel after walking across the country. It's one of those things we put off in the future, like it's out there, but does it really ever happen? And all of a sudden you see the sign. That was really powerful. There was some really mixed feelings. There was, there was uh, sadness, there was excitement, and, and things that I want to portray in the book.